Well, AI, I'd say that you know, it's going to raise productivity generally. In normal capital markets with great competition from Microsoft and Google will drive that. And you should all pay attention because it is so dramatic how it improves white collar productivity. And later with the robotics, not yet, but eventually blue collar productivity. So that is phenomenal for the world. The world will be richer and you know, can work less and have, have more. The place where it, it's with equity, and, and we have a huge commitment to make sure there's not this normal 20-year lag between benefit to the rich versus to developing countries, is that there's a bigger teacher shortage in Africa than elsewhere, a bigger doctor shortage. And so not only will we invent new tools using AI, like the ultrasound, we will provide health advice um, and directly you know, in their local African language, uh, fully tailored to the conditions in those countries, we will provide an AI doctor, we will provide an AI tutor. And already we've funded lots of Africans to do pilot studies and to take the very best technology and get it out uh, at about the same time as it'll happen in the rich world. In fact, in a few cases, rich world regulations may make it roll out slower than in countries like India or in Africa. So it's a race, but it's a race uh, for good. And you know, I couldn't be more thrilled. You know, it's a case where my work, ongoing work with Microsoft you know, helps me understand how we take this into the developing countries. So, but overall, your net positive on AI in general, globally? AI, like for everything. Is, AI is, it, is a brilliant tool uh, for people to be more productive. Now. It means the bad guys will be more productive, so they can do more cyber attacks, so they can design weapons. You always, you know, the internet, the microprocessor, all these things uh, helped everybody be more efficient, including the bad guys. And so you, you've got to make sure the best AI for cyber defense or, you know, measures to defend against bioterrorism are in the hand of the good guys. And, you know, it, it's a challenge, but and you know, people sometimes lose sight of the fact that this is the biggest productivity advance in, in our lifetimes.